Hello there guys, uh, Echo Bad Creations here and today I'm going to show you a little tip and tricks on first rate making. Today's episode, I'm going to show you how I do the snouts. Um, this is a major thing that I do before anything else, I just do the snout. So um, I haven't got any balaclavas in yet because I'm taking a break but um well i'm cutting out the pieces ready for when i get back in um i'm gonna be making a bat so the snout is gonna be a bit shorter than a wolf or a cat will be a lot shorter but yeah i'll be in the middle because uh i'm making a fruit bat maybe i haven't really decided yet but it's gonna be a bat um, we're going to do a small muzzle, kind of like a cat, I guess. Um, so, normally you'll need a balaclava, so you cover the thing with a balaclava. Make sure you've got face piece here. Um, yeah. So you pop that down. So this is like your face. You can put your face against there and then draw this out on. But it's just easier to get yourself your phone head and then you draw your shape on so your eyes are going to be here and this is where your chin is so this is your bottom jaw area so you want to draw from here so you want to go down and then out to the size that you want it so what's the size I want I do the base sketch down with a marker or Taylor chalk, I think will work. I don't know, I never use Taylor chalk. So, yeah. Um, there's your muzzle. If you want a dog, you'll go out up to here, maybe. Depends on the type of dog you're doing, or wolf. Um, so, on to a small muzzle like that. And what you do is, if it's a thick foam like this, this is double what you need. It should be an inch. I think this is an inch and a half. You do three of these to four so you do three or four times of these and then you stick them so they stack about there you glue them together and you glue them on um what else you need to do while well, you got it like this see like i said you need the bottom jaw here you go in about here go a bit and then do your bottom jaw like that so you do it attached on like that and then when you cut, you cut here and you do the same with this, you do 3 to 4 of them depending on the thickness you're using you can do any thickness if you've got mega thick like big fat block you can just do one and just carve it down to the size you need because your nose will be there and once you have done your block I'll just show you how what you need to do with that okay so now you should have your bottom muzzle and your top muzzle um, well jaw and mm, top jaw um, glued together like this I've done free thickness for more thinner look and yeah so this should go together like that do not glue it together like this um, you're supposed to glue it to balaclava um, so what I like to do is we need to carve this bit out and the bottom of this a little bit so what you need to do is grab yourself a marker and you want to um, put how um, deep you want your bottom jaw this is to help with breathing and ventilation so I'm just going to quickly draw on what I need to draw on and yeah so as you can see I have cut out here where it needs to be carved out as you know this bit needs to be like shaped 
but you want it carved out here so you have nice bottom ventilation for and here you want it to be carved out like here so you have the top um you have the parts of the animal where it like pops down and you have the space for your nose and of course your mouth again so yeah it's nice and roomy and um, soft as well because you need it nice and cut cut nice and soft yeah so you don't want any glue showing so you try your best not to have any glue showing where your nose goes or where your face goes and of course when you've carved it out you stick it on <coughs> what other things you can do is always like cut out round bits here and here to build it up a bit more you only need it a little bit more here depending how much you cut so yeah because your nose will go around here and you want to shave it to however you want whether you want a smile you want a frown you shape it up like that so you build on top of these so um i'll go I'll go through the next videos on how to build up facial features and I'll continue with this series. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next tutorial. Ciao!